the idea behind the, the transgender movement as a civil rights movement is the idea that all of their problems would just go away if I would pretend that they were the sex to which they claim, uh, to which they claim membership. That's nonsense. The transgender suicide rate is 40%. It is 40%. And according to, the, according to the Anderson School at UCLA, it makes no difference. They, there's a study that came out last year. It makes no difference, virtually no difference, statistically speaking, as to whether people recognize you as a transgender person or not, which suggests there's a very high comorbidity between transgenderism, whatever that mental state may be, and suicidality. That has nothing to do with how society treats The idea that, that sex or gender are malleable is not true. Okay? And I'm not denying your humanity if you're a transgender person. I am saying that you are not the sex to which you claim to be. You're still a human being, and you're a human being with an issue that I'm, you know, I wish you Godspeed in, in dealing with in whatever way you see fit. But if you are going to dictate to me that I'm supposed to pretend, I'm supposed to pretend that men are women and women are men, no. My answer is no. I'm not, going to, I'm not going to modify basic biology because it threatens your subjective sense of what you are. Okay, but you're still saying these kids should like, not be accepted because they don't really fit in either place? They can't just like... I'm saying that the Boy Scouts have a standard. You must be a biological boy to be a Boy Scout.